Hey, hello, hello, hello. Uh, okay, so many things right now. Um, oh, oh shit. Hold on. Something is not right. Okay. Some reason not everything is set up right now. Why? Oh shit. Okay, perfect. There we go. Okay. Hello, hello. I apologize. So, one, I was supposed to have sent a tweet out earlier saying that I was doing this. Um, but for some reason, the place I, I, at work. Um, the Wi-Fi was down uh, for various hours. I tried to go send that out at my car, but I guess the tweet didn't go out at all. And so nobody knows, I guess, right now that I'm even doing Bioshock Infinite. So uh, I apologize if I'm a little bit late. Uh, and yeah, so shit was weird today. That, that's all. So, if you didn't get, get the notification I was doing this Monday, I'm doing it now. Uh, so, we're playing Bioshock Infinite. Uh, and, boy, is shit just going wrong right now trying to stream this. Hold on. Because I'm trying to have the chat up, but that's not even being put up right now. Okay, now it's up. Okay, cool. Anyways, uh, <laughs> so we, we, we've obviously finished Bioshock 1. Uh, we got that out of the way. Um, and people really asked, hey, are you doing Bioshock 2? No, obviously. Uh, I decided I didn't want to do Bioshock 1 only because uh, it just wasn't what I was... I looked into it already before, and it just wasn't interesting to me. Um, it has an interesting premise, but it's just, I don't know, it just didn't seem like it would be all that fun for, to me. So I decided I'm just going to skip that and just go on to Bioshock Infinite. Now, that's not to say that before I streamed this, I didn't look back into Bioshock 2 on my off time and just pretty much look at the story and what I know from it now. So, pretty much to give a uh, summary of Bioshock 2, uh, Bioshock 2, just, you're Big Daddy, you have a little sister named, uh, I think, um, Elliot, really, it's something with the E, I, I honestly forgot, um, but, uh, Pretty much, uh, you guys are attached to each other. Uh, you then come to f meet her actual born mother, who was the one that created all uh, the Big Daddy Control. Uh, was it uh, the the spice? Pretty much to control Big Daddies. Uh, she used one on you and uh, made you kill yourself. Uh, the thing about Big Daddies is they never really truly die, apparently, as long as uh, they're still connected to their little sisters. If there are no little sisters, then they die for, for good. Um, but the little sister was still alive, and so there was a chance for the Big Daddy to come back. The little sister used uh, every power she could to bring the uh, Big Daddy back to life ten years later. Um, holy shit, there is something wrong with the chat. Like, on my streaming side. I, I don't know if somebody is trying to chat right now on there and it's just not picking up. Or, hold on. Review, recent raids. Oh, no. Pause chat. No. What happens if I clear chat? Okay. I cleared it for now. It, 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 hopefully, it's able to uh, reset it. Because it's bugging out on my end right now. Um, okay. So, yeah. Um, and then, uh, later on, you find, um, find out that your uh, 
little sister pretty much uh, brought you back to life. Uh, meanwhile, you're just finding a way to get back to her and free her from rapture, pretty much. Uh, meanwhile, you find out that the canon ending was what we chose before. Uh, the ending where the little sisters are free from rapture and you bring them back to the surface, leaving rapture in ruins. Because there are no Andrew Ryans and there are no Atlas or uh, Fontaine. Um, and without either of them, their uh, Rapture is unleadership, uncontrolled. And that's where uh, this little sister's mother comes in. She then tries to bring everyone together by uh, pledging that uh, they're, they're unified, that no matter what race or no matter what. Uh, what everyone looks like, we're all together, and we're better than Atlas and uh, Ryan put together. So, yeah, and, and then we find out uh, later on that that's all bullshit, and uh, she's really just using everyone uh, to get what she wants in the end. She's a natural manipulator. Uh, you, you also find uh, that... Uh, uh, there's a lot of people that helped in the capturing of the little sister before um, when they were experimenting with Big Daddies. Uh, your character, Delta, is actually some guy who didn't even belong in Rapture in the first place. He was just captured and turned into this thing. Um, uh, the little sister was kidnapped as a child and forced to merge with this Big Daddy. Uh, holy shit, that chat is fucking up. I might have to end the stream and restart it. Oh my god, I hope not. We'll see. We'll see what happens. If someone can message me on like Twitch directly if you're watching. And I, not Twitch. Uh, well, yeah, if you want to message me directly on Twitch, I'll, I'll check to make sure the chat's not fucking up. And then I'll have to like restart the stream over again just to see what the hell's going on um but yeah so um yeah so pretty much skip all the like various factions kill kidnappers or you choose not you pretty much have a morality depending on who you choose to rescue and who you don't choose to rescue meanwhile you're trying to rescue uh, a bunch of like little sisters and uh inevitably you you pan out what you want to raise your little sister from the beginning of the game as um so and, and then it comes together on what type of big sister which is the other race of big daddies in this game they're like little sisters that have grown up into being like their uh their mr bubbles or big daddy um and uh Pretty much, you, you create your daughter to being so. Um, and I guess that's the big reveal as well. She's technically your biological daughter. It, it's weird. I don't know what the connection there was. But, um, but yeah, you, uh, uh, going down, you, you choose wh whether you want to kill her mother or you want to save her and she makes that choice depending on your other moralities and she ends up saving her but in doing so in, in doing so uh, rescuing her you end up dying in the process and um, they do this mind melting thing where technically your big daddy doesn't die but becomes one with the little sister and she become it uh, she saves all the little sisters and brings them to the surface again that was bioshock 2 i thought it just wasn't me it just wasn't what i kind of liked about bioshock 1 and it's just it's kind of reheating it a little bit just giving people the option to be big daddies little sisters and uh big sisters if you will so um eh not, not what I'm looking for, but you know what? I wanted for the longest to play this game specifically, Bioshock Infinite. Now, I've played this game multiple times before, and I know its ins and outs, and 
what I like most about this game. Um, uh, mainly its environment, uh, just this aesthetic of, uh, of the American pride, the American way. But if you dig deeper, you find that there's a lot more like shit out, a lot more shit underneath, just, just like America. Um, um, and with that, you have like American pride, you have, um, undertone racisms. I mean, you get a little bit of that in uh, Bioshock 2, uh, but they don't talk more into it other outside of, like, certain characters. Oh, hold on. Drink this tea. Because I've been talking for a while. Hmm. Okay. So, yeah. You get a little bit of that. Um... You, uh, and kind of Bioshock Infinite explores into that a little bit more. So, um, yeah, let, let's get right into it. I think I'll explain more, um, uh, as I go. Uh, you, also, just so a lot of people are aware, they're asking, do I put, am I going to play, uh, the music in this game or not? I'm not going to, it's... It's, if anything, it's all going to be a little low and hard to hear. Only because I almost got flagged on a bunch of videos in the past with Bioshock 1. And this game has a lot of licensed music in it. Um, mainly because part of the theme in this game is bringing songs from the future back to the past. So that's why I'm just not going to be able to play a lot of the music in this game, and um, that's where we're, that's where we stand right now for the music in this game. Um, until I hear otherwise, it's just going to be really low. It's not going to be loud, but low enough to where it's not going to flag me if people hear certain music in there, and uh, enough to where I can tell what songs I can play and what I can't play. It, it's weird. I, I'm able to play... A lot of this music in here is... Uh, uh, like, they've created their own versions of futuristic songs. So I'm not even sure if that counts as uh, unlicensed music or not. So you'll hear versions of uh, um, Girls Wanna Have Fun. But in this time... So I don't know if that's okay. So... Let's just get right into the game, and we'll explain a little bit later. So, this is Bioshock Infinite. So, <laughs> yes, new game. This one I like the difficulty. Um, depending on what how you play it, you can play easy mode, medium, hard. Um, and then there's 1983 mode, which is super hard. I think if you die once. You start over from the beginning. And that's pretty cool. <clears throat> so what's interesting about that logo is... Okay. Obviously, this is a different Are aesthetic. Of God? Oh, oh. No. I forgot about subtitles. But I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. Very trans transdimensional. Oh, okay. <laughs> 1912, Coast of Maine. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Hold on. I want to put on subtitles. Or not subtitles. Audio, yeah. Rowing. Rowing. I planned on it. So you expect me to show What's you the this? burden? No. But I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea. I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing. No. <clears throat> Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? <clears throat> one goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. 
one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do. Oh, we're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does. Bring me the girl, and, and the debt will be paid. He doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. So, knowing what happens at the end of this game, I just thought these guys were just talking about nonsense. But they're actually talking about something in the game itself. He's not moving. He will, eventually. Oh, hold on. I suppose he does. <laughs> I'm guessing they, they go on and on talking unless you get out of the boat. I think... There's something on YouTube where if you stay in the boat, it's instant game over. So let's not do that. <laughs> Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? Might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Yes. There's someone inside. So yeah, you can find already in the beginning of this game, you can find like different money here. Di yeah, different money. You can find like a bunch of coins laying around. Also, please let me know if chat is fucking up right now. Um, I honestly don't know how chat is right now for Twitch. It looks fine on my phone. I have that as like a backup in case I'm not able to see anything on uh, my stream chat. Um, but on stream chat, it's glitching up super bad where it keeps posting, welcome to the chat room, welcome to the chat room. I don't know if it's resetting or not. But if it's fucking up, please message me either on Twitter or message me on uh, Twitch directly, letting me know that the chat's not doing I'm gonna assume it's okay. Yeah, you can search barrels. I gotta remember A is to jump. Because in uh, Bioshock 1, Y is to jump. At least I remember. It was Y. And A was to like to grab shit. A is to jump. X is to grab shit. What brings us the girl and wipe away the debt? This is your last chance. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. Uh, I guess you're expecting me. Of thy sins shall I wash. I do not remember Booker looking like Good that. With that pal. <laughs> so yeah, as I was going to say before, the aesthetic of this game was going to be a lot different. Um, mainly it was going to match a lot of the original two Bioshocks, dark, gloomy, and uh, very creepy. But they decided at the last minute to change it. Like, I think they saw something in this game that was going to be a lot different. Um, seeing as this was, was their last Bioshock game. Um, like, uh, as you can see, like, from past E3 reveals, um, a lot of the, uh, splice, the splicers were going to return. It seemed like people were, like, glitching up as if there were fat fabrics from different timelines. And it's just... It was going to be different. Uh, like, I think you were in the middle of a large election, and pe people were fighting our faction on who was going to run uh, Colombia. <laughs> and that's just from seeing what they gave us at the E3. Um, your your character was going to be dressed different. Uh, Elizabeth was going to be dressed a lot different. Like she was going to have. Uh, your Cortana type hair or your weird 
or you're pretty much early 2000s hairstyle of uh, uh, women in uh, Resident Evil or women in uh, uh, what's that one movie uh, the, the the fifth element yeah uh, but sorry uh, from Sodom shall I leave thee is anyone here hello Delvon. Nothing. Not the timeline. You, you got me there. There's a lot of. There's a lot of, about this timeline that just doesn't add up. Like how old your character is and how many wars he's been in. Let's see, uh, Gulf of Mexico. Be prepared. He's on his way. You must stop him. See. See. Which one was C? Was that one of the twins? Anyways, yeah, this pathway is going to make a lot sense later. I wonder if I can get up here and see what year this map is. It doesn't say. I guess it's just a map in their perspective. Just, there's no, like, timeline. Then again, I think it's 1913 this takes place in? To thine own land shall I take thee. This towns off in the distance now that can mean one of two things depending on the timeline of this oh Shit. I didn't even see him excuse me sir I'm gonna rob you yeah chat is fucking up If I refresh the chat, will that help it stop fucking up? Don't disappoint us. I'm guessing he is a guard. Like, he was supposed to stop someone like you from coming to the lighthouse. In New Eden soil shall I plant. Okay, so there's like three towns off in the distance. And they're very bright for these type uh, the, uh, these types of towns. I'm guessing there there might be on fire, and we'll get to that when we get to that. We man that card. Scroll. Key. Sword, sword. Huh. What in the world is. If I saw this, I'd be scared as shit. much of a debt is it that you're willing to get into a random chair in a random lighthouse in a random place that you've never been? Uh, 
No, no. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bindings are there as a safeguard. No, no, God! Oh, damn it! Ascension. Ascension. Surprisingly, we'll find plenty of guns. No, 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 no. Three, two, one. Ascension. Ascension. Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Fifteen thousand feet. Hallelujah. So beautiful. Like, this is definitely different from uh, the first two Bioshocks. Like, whoever the art director for this game is, is downright amazing. Like, they want to make this a special. Father Comstock, our prophet. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna assume just the chat's okay, unless I see otherwise. Living in the clouds. Oh, if we not rise the finger of our own salvation, and now we deserve this mercy. He has led us to the new Eden. Our last chance for redemption. And I really wish we could have gotten a lot of the music in this game if it wasn't for like copyright strikes. And the prophet shall lead the people to the new Eden. So to these guys, this guy is like Jesus Christ. <laughs> like, this is one hell of a hunt. Yeah, so it's just like Bioshock, a lot of stuff they kept, such as navigations, um, <laughs> definitely that sound. That vault opening sound. Look at this, just the mural alone shows you the art direction they want to go in. And this woman, that baby, will probably come in handy later. That baby, definitely. The seed of the prophet shall sit in the throne and drown in the flame. The mountains of man. That is threatening as shit. And in my womb shall grow the seed of God. All bullshit. There's a tape around here somewhere. There it is. Now I will play a lot of the love audio the tapes. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Love the sinner yeah. because he is you. Without the sin, out of this place. is there for a redeemer. Without sin. Grace has forgiveness. The seed of the prophet. <laughs> Excuse me. Where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. Let's keep such questions hey, to myself. Hey, I know that myself, voice actor. I want to get made. 
That's, uh, Principal Lewis from, uh, American Dad. <laughs> and you know how to say QK? The land, the future of the city. See? That baby did come in handy later. At least I thought that was a baby. Yeah, I feel really bad that I wasn't able to send that tweet out letting people know I was playing this game today. Because there's a lot of people who probably want to see this today. That's, that's alright. I'll make it up. I have other games in, uh, planned up and scheduled. Um, one will probably end up doing some more Spider-Man stuff. Or Spider-Man likes stuff. The Gladium. The Gladium? Gladium. Whatever. The Glade. Clat? Clavin? Clavin. That is. Val Valumen. <laughs> now they're just making it work. And every <laughs> year, on this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of and lo, if the prophet had struck down our enemies at wounded knee and not railed against hey. the sun <laughs> beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the sun beneath us, but not accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, but not expelled the Vox Populi, it would have been enough. So yeah, these people Is worship someone America, new, someone from the almost to a cult, newly a come to point. Columbia to be washed clean before our prophet, our founders, and our Lord. I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Excuse me. My nose is stuffy as hell. Glory be. Might as well get it over Reach with. Out, brother. Come and be cleansed. Hallelujah! <laughs> hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know. Like, it, it's almost sad how realistic this game is to the religious factor in America. There. Bring us the curb and wipe away the deck. What do you want? We had a deal to it. Open this door right now. I told you. I'm not gonna do it. Now go away. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt. So better get used to this room. We're gonna you're gonna see this room a lot. And you'll find like little details, like one, he's a heavy drinker. Uh, the amount of like debt he has, like he, he's been to the uh, racetracks a little bit too much. Smoker, he's a detective. 
he, he, he's a uh, ex marine or a corporal. I should have done now. And if you get near the store, you'll hear baby sounds on the other end. Spoilers. Look at the way. Investigations into what was that say? Matters both public and private. Huh? Okay, so this is what I mean by the city being on fire or not. <gasps> Whoa, Franklin! <laughs> that idiot priest needs to learn the difference Daddy between Washington. a man and drowning one. <laughs> Big Daddy Jefferson. Mark and figure out where the hell I am. A key of gold so that Eden might have industry that set her above all other nations. To Father Jefferson. A scroll, so that Eden might have laws that set her above all other nations. And so each year we recommit ourselves to our founders and our prophet, Father Comstock. And, and recommit to, to our, our prophet, prophet, Father, Father Comstock. Comstock this so that we may follow in the prophet's all path. Amen. too familiar. All too familiar. Our prophet fills our lungs with water so they may better love the air. Okay. Whatever you say, buddy. So yeah, a lot different from Bioshock 1, where in order to get your health back, you have to, like, uh, get a bunch of health pack. No, if you want to get your health back in this world, you just eat random shit. Just eat everything. What is Columbia, if not another arc for... Another time. Well, that he means the something Delaware different later. With flaming sword and wings of angels, watch over me and lend me strength. Shield my mind from fear and doubt, so that I may hold fast against all invaders. Father Washington, hear my prayer. Oh, Big Daddy, Zaddy Washington. <laughs> Rebel against ignorance and tyranny. Share with me your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine like a beacon through the darkness. Father Jefferson, hear my prayer. Oh my god. By the sword and, and the, the scroll, scroll and, and the, the key. key. Amen. Amen. Columbus, hear my prayer. <laughs> you may have smite all those uh, natives. But they didn't. It's not like they didn't deserve it. <laughs> There's no chance, no luck, only providence. And that you see its divine hand at work, you discern. Oh, the Father Trump. Your inspiration and imagination transcend <laughs> see, see, see what I mean? science and oh, open our God, eyes to the mystery. Father Franklin, hear my prayer. Well, just because the city flies, don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. Right. Yeah. So got a girl to find. I like how he's unfazed by all this religious cult and stuff. And here we are, poster scene. Teeth was hurting. Mm. So I have many questions about the blowing city here. What happens when like a bad gust of wind just comes by? Like, are they just fucked? <laughs> like, do, does the city just blow it off? 
It's not like they have an anchor or anything. Like, look, there's like no anchor around these things. So they can just fly off anyway. Like, no, Mr. Rossignol. I've never had an oyster. <laughs> I bet we could have something arranged. And definitely, you get to see this world before, like, stuff goes right. bad. Good to see you. Excuse me, I'm just gonna eat this food without paying it. Thank you kindly. All of Colombia celebrates. Can't exactly read what they're celebrating about. <laughs> that kid literally saw me steal his money. Columbia raffle and oh yeah, it's just a random festival. I think it's celebrating the anniversary of uh, the death of his wife. Statue. I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute, you know, divinity. Are you kidding me? He looks like fucking Zeus up there. That's that not divinity enough? Like does not matter to a Liberty Scout. There's no room for preference, only duty. The only difference between him and God right now is just God wouldn't be so flashy. Fair. That's enough of that kind of talk. Sometimes I don't know if I'm raising a duke. Dimwit. Oh, I forgot this duke. Is a right, I tell you. Says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? But you know, it, 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 it's it's good that nobody's uh, people aren't able to see this right now. Um, I'll always post on YouTube just past streams, so I'm going to be posting this and uh, the Gears of War stream uh, sometime tomorrow. And a clip from Gears that was kind of funny. Literally, the, the um, environment pretty much pays you if you go looking for like stuff. Never hire an artist, my dear fellow. They are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh huh. I told him that the I park is exceedingly far behind that schedule. As an the, artist. The, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Uh huh. Uh huh. Do you know what he told me? He said that he was tired, that, that the work had taken much from him. I said, good God, man, don't tell me about details, just get it done. Mm-hmm. You almost finished down there? Yes, sir. I think I could actually, like, steal stuff here. I think. Oh, this tape. Then, the Archangel showed a vision. A city, lighter than air. I asked her, why do you show this to me, Archangel? I'm not a strong man. I'm not a righteous man. I am not a holy man. And she told me the most remarkable thing. You're right, Prophet. But if grace is within the grasp of one like, situation... Look at that. Is that How not amazing? Anyone else not see it in themselves? So who the archangel is is very interesting to me. Like, there's no way the prophet would have come up with all this himself. Like, he genuinely believes an angel came to him and said, Hey, make a city. Chat is messing up on my head.
It's fine. It literally says dream. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Fox Popular, that. Now, what does Fox Popular even mean, for heaven's sake? Uh, it's Latin. It means. Latin. <laughs> <laughs> Does she just smirk at Latin as if that's not American? Uh, the tower protects the lamb, the false from the false shepherd. Uh, any place to explore? No. Good day, citizen. You're looking fit. I don't roll that way, sir. <laughs> I mean, I might. What are you doing later? <laughs> what? I wouldn't know like that. This is interesting. So this is a functionally working horse. Using Adam, or their version of Adam. To attend on a day like today is serious business, you know. Can't be everywhere at once. <laughs> You'll always miss something. That's why we're going to the raffle. I have a good feeling this year. I think they mentioned something about um, about. I think Dewitt mentions uh, before that why the is there any news fair. about <laughs> a city like this? That's a good question. No, I don't get what you mean. <laughs> Strong of the sword. <laughs> his scroll is in his anus. Guys, and light variable oh, wind throughout the afternoon. In short, a beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. And now, back to the music. Oh, we're a little bit drunk. Ugh. <laughs> I don't want to hear about the Vox Popular. <laughs> you are on your honor. Put money in the basket. Founders bless you. Oh! Well, I feel bad. Here you go. Ah, <laughs> not kidding. <laughs> I fuck this place. Like, literally, when you find out how much of a shit people are here, you don't feel bad for stealing money from them. You definitely don't pay. Is this girl? False shepherd seeks to lead our lamb astray. Is it the communists? <laughs> Watch out for Hitler. He's actually pretty good in this time. I'm not sure. 
Okay, so us okay, it, so it's not playing so loud. So usually, this is a good example as in the type of music that's in this game. God only knows is a, a Beach Boy song, and they made their own version by having a quartet sing a version of the song. Uh, so if, if the song was any louder, uh, you would hear them hum and do the do do do's from that uh, Beach Boy song. And obviously you see people dancing to it. So yeah, this is a good example as in the, the type of music that is in the song. What they even call themselves? The uh, Albert Fink presents Columbia's Gayest Quartet. <laughs> The music of tomorrow today. Yeah, so yeah, God only knows. But that yeah. Get used to things like that in this game. You'll even hear you like a boutonniere? We're raising money for the girls' patriotic league. <laughs> Maybe next time. You'd look dashing with one in your lapel. Come back if you change your mind. You, you'll get a lot of that in this game, pretty much. Is what I'm to say. Man. I need more money and trash to eat around here. Yes, I said it. I eat money, too. One man goes into the waters of baptism. A different man comes out, born again. But who is that man who lies submerged? I'm not gonna lie, a lot of these tapes are Perhaps pretty much that swimmer is both sinner and saint until he is revealed it, onto the It's eyes like of man. hearing Trump talk about nothing and go into circles and just rev up the Trump supporters. And uh, other people will be like, well, he just said he, he's going to burn the world. Ah, fake news. Wrong by the Vox Populi. Like, this game holds up today, unfortunately. <laughs> Turn into some faint and radical on me, John. I do not want to be some character out of I Married a Box Popular, now do I? <laughs> what do you mean, uh, equality woman? <laughs> That's communist talk. <laughs> yeah, that's where they said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. New text. <laughs> also, stop. Do not stop stopping. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Do, don't unstop stopping stop. Stop. Okay, yeah, this is an interesting uh, Easter egg. So you'll see the twins pretty much everywhere in this game. Uh, for good reasons, too. And they are, they disappear. may be wondering why do they keep showing up well that's for details later my good day to you sir hello they explained it but just not in good details we'll get to that in a little bit you also may be wondering to yourself this game is missing something uh, you know, like beginning of every Bioshock, there's certain powers you get. 
You know, that's where all the immigrants used to pass through. Well, this is with the fair. They still from. allowed average Janes and Joes to enter. You know, you gotta be somebody now. I gotta be somebody. Hello there, friend. Oh, yeah. You wanna let me through here, pal? Hey, streets closed for your safety, fella. They're prepping tonight's fireworks back there. There's enough TNT back there to blow Peking to Kingdom Come. Again. Road block. Better find another way around. His fingers now. Would you believe me? No. Nope. If I told you a man could hoist a one-ton stallion straight into the air, would you believe me? Murder of crows. Well, friend, Devil's I'm kiss. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. Shock no, jock. Sir, no, ma'am. Those are biggers I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself. So, this is definitely different from uh, Bioshock. At the tips of your fingers. One. You know our profit is fair. You know our prophet is kind, and he has asked, personally asked Mr. Jeremiah Fink to bring to you these amazing wonders. Praise be to our prophet, and praise be to our fair city. So yeah, these are uh, if I told you a man could biggers lightning from his fingers. From Jeremiah Fink. Would you believe me? Can you guess what if I told you a uh, figures are? Ton stallion straight into They're pretty the much like uh, the um, well, friends, the junkies from uh, Bioshock One. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool. I mean, uh, the, the no, stuff sir, that they no take man. Place. Those are figures I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Or Adam. Sarah they're they're pretty much Adam. And uh, they found like variations of Adam here in this plane, and where they could find them. Envy all his peers. Look, look at Johnny and his friends, because Jimmy's dad gave him the pack of smokes, cigarettes for kids, minor victory. A band of discipline for kids. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. Oh, yeah, let's play. Find the devil, good sir, and young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, the devil three times. Yeah, we gotta be fast too, I think. Oh, yeah. We don't wanna hit the woman. Yeah, we get more coins. It kind of sets us up for the most of the game. I think we get like three different prizes from this thing, but we won't spend too much time on these uh, mini games. This is not the show. Dirty box are at it again. See them villains zipping around, spreading their lies and dissent. Fear not. I got just the Oh boy. Oh boy. This is what the, the box populi are. If you if you're not aware. Oh god. The aiming system in this is pretty good. Ah, 
thought that was Daisy Fitzroy. Second place. What the fuck? I was at second place. Keep the skies clear. Grab a gun and show those box who run this city. Good man. Now take aim and blast those evil box out of this guy. Hit enough and I'll get you a prize. I'm going for number one. Ah, oh, there we go. First place. That's much better. I think Daisy Fitzroy shows up. Yeah, you get like a bonus point. That's that's a pretty good looking clown. Hey, look how strong we are. Automated staff. We're on a romantic evening ride with the missus. He hauls carriages, vending items, furniture, and more. From the heaviest item to your most delicate. Oh, yeah, that's not great. Aren't you kids a little bit too old to be smoking? Or too, too, too young. And <laughs> not too old. Yeah, the chat's like fucking odd. Yeah, if, if the chat's still not working, yeah, please let me know. It's just gonna suck if the chat's not working and nobody can talk to me. Oh, nothing's better. We're trying not to do a lot of exploring, because I know it wastes a lot of time. The fire. Honest. Nearly blew the windows out of my house. Advances in science and wonder we've seen in our lifetime. Soon enough, Fink and Lutes will be sending folks to the moon. Wouldn't that be something? Moon people. <laughs> yeah, right. The moon. Hot we'll dogs, never get to the moon. Dogs, ever. Alexander Hot Dogs, Columbia's finest, worth every cent. Red Hot Hot Dogs, Colombian is apple pie, patriotic as a rifle. Delicious as a sweetheart's kiss. Boxophone, boxophone. Hear your voice from the past in the present. Say What's a boxophone? What's a boxophone? What's a boxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. What are you trying to sell me, huh? Those fancy, smancy box up phones. Have you seen Nobody's gonna use that. I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks with them. It's safer that way. That's what it was. We're supposed to use our a, a different type of gun to shoot Daisy Fitzroy. Okay, yeah, <laughs> they want us to buy the fucking Bronco, and I think you can actually do that if you buy enough. If you play enough games here, you can collect enough money to buy uh, the fucking Bronco early on. Why would you want it so early? I don't know. Now, shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. What? Well done, sir. 
Oh shit. Hey, I think it first place. Yeah. Look at us go. See, yeah, they're pretty easy to get through. Even know what you're doing. Another form of music that we get here. It's not perfect. Oh my god. Oh boy. So, you remember the Big Daddy? Come on down. The, is he this the is the same thing. Handyman. Is he man? Is he machine? Only Colombian ingenuity could create such an amazing moment. And look how much he hates. He hates it. He hates being here. So this is their version of a big daddy in this universe, but you don't really see a lot of them in this game, unfortunately. You, you fight them every now and then, but the big daddy was much more fierce. These guys are, uh, they're more like the brutes in, uh, in Bioshock 2? Yeah, Bioshock 2. And the brutes are pretty much they're they're a different type of slicers, uh, but larger. Step right up and see the eighth wonder of yeah, the look at this guy. He's, this guy is not pretty looking. Handyman. Only in our fair city will you see such amazing feats of technological prowess. And this is their like their solution to people who are sick and dying. Place them and put their heart in a jar. And put their head on a plate. Have you ever seen anything like it? It looks so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? Well, not having an actual body? What's wrong with good old vanilla? Four flavors? Ugh! Imagine how many flavors they'll come up with next. It's my only vice. Howdy, sailor. What port do you call home? Any port in the storm? No, I don't. No, I, are you trying to have uh, relations with me, sir? I don't roll that way. I told the last guy that. Or maybe I did. <laughs> a lot of people are assuming I will that way. Have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Has a pay telephone ever refused to connect you with a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your will. Really? So this is the solution to hacking in this game. Instead of actually going through like a, a mini game, they actually give you the power to hack from afar. With just a whisper, they're all ears. <laughs> hey, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> what did you just give me? These drugs ain't shit. Press to turn machines into allies. And just a basic tutorial of how these things work. There's not, not much to it. They're short and sweet. Well, if it isn't a step limit, you 
Sanford. Your spot at the raffle awaits. Don't know why I didn't recognize you before. Odd. Always good to have gentlemen of your caliber at our fine fairgrounds. All right, be right back. Because if the possession worked on that, I can only imagine what it would do. Look at this. Give us a whole lot of money. Okay, well, it doesn't work like that yet. Well, good nerve, right? And this Heads. is what I mean. Or tails. Come the on, twins are through. everywhere. Heads. Or tails. Huh. Um. Heads. Heads. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. They also have a very interesting theme song. We won't leave until you do. You have my word on that. My, my. They really mean that. Yeah, so the kids make folk tales from the uh, creature that lives around. Tomorrow, today. And we don't need to buy anything from those vending machines. He looks lost. <laughs> he looks just fine to me. Mary, you are a living, walking scandal. <laughs> ladies, ladies, there's more of me to go around. will be taking in new stock soon. There's something else around here that we need to do. Oh yeah, there you go. Good night, Irene. I really hope that is allowed. My Lady Comstock, of course. The, the prophet, prophet bless her and keep her. Suffering don't make you holy. Well, it certainly doesn't hurt. Technically, it's not a song, and it's not. It's their version of Goodnight Ari. So I don't know. This little beauty, uh, the whole division got them. We're gonna flush the box out of the Skyline system. We gotta have the best. Uh -huh. You got any openings in the group? I'd love to bust some box skull. <laughs> no. I'm gonna have to probably use the bathroom later. <laughs> Drinking a lot like this. Her statues move for weird reasons. Oh, they're playing cops with eyes. Get his ass! Get, get him! Pew! It's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you were allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, uh, I, I should like to meet her, her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. I don't think I can get past. Nah, nah, it <laughs> won't let me. So, does she look familiar? I hope she does, but she'll come back later. Okay, 
So I think this will be it for exploring for a while. Why? Because of that. And walking around in this environment is not great for people like us. AD, okay, now I remember what that symbol was, AD. Jeremiah Fink wants you to attend the July 6th raffle. If you don't join, you're a communist. You belong in the slums, ha ha ha. So we have no choice but to uh, attend the rap. If we didn't and we found a way behind these guys, that'd be Sorry, son, this street is closed. I'm gonna try to talk over as much over the song as possible. Cause I really don't want to get uh, docs just for a song that I even know was licensed or not. We'll see about that. I'm feeling better. Good night, Irene. Good night. Like it was bullshit. The amount of times like I got like copyright claims and like passed by a shot. Okay. They're very old songs in those games that I didn't even know were licensed at this time. And now, like they the they do the most. Twelve raffle has officially begun. Mister, Mister. Sorry. Where Jeremiah <laughs> teleported? Silly. There's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that Damn. not the Booker must be the, the shit in this time of night. All, of Columbia? <laughs> all right then. The winner is number 77. Well, what do you know? Hey, I'm a winner. Hey Raptors, how you doing? Claim your prize. Glad you could come by. I, I was I was hoping chat wasn't fucked. Oh boy. Oh god. Yeah. Please, what are you doing? I hope everyone get, gets used to the racist. I wanna say not undertone this oh god. <laughs> Not even oh, undertone. This is just like we've got a shy one here. <laughs> we got to do something you, about that. Bitch. Wait. <laughs> it's him. Yeah, there's no way I was going to pick. Don't Who would pick the out other out one? Way. Well, don't you know that I know you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? Oh. Well, I'm glad you could come out anyways. I know I was shit announcing that this uh, I was going to play infinite, but I'm glad something <laughs> Even if their sleeping schedule is not great. Oh. Stop him! Stop him! The got to lead yeah, this is. Oh! Oh! Okay! <laughs> okay, I don't remember that thing decapit wow. decapitating people. I remember it like breaking people's necks, but I didn't know it just took their head clean off their body. Okay, so violence warning. Uh <laughs> Come on. Come on. Move it. Move it. Disconnect. Disconnect. Oh, what the fuck? Oh god, it's bloody. Okay, let me get changed it to the remaster. Okay, yeah. I think that's why. It's a remaster version, so 
it got violent. Okay, that, that's what I'll, I, I remembered was breaking people's necks. You're under arrest. Time to get this done. Yeah, cool. So really, death doesn't really matter in this game. That's it. I mean, it kind of mattered in uh, Bioshock 1, but not really. Anarchists lose in our fair city. Comstock, you sell them paradise, and the customers expect sheriffs. Oh, we'll get more potions. Every chore, <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well, I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> it's about to get really racist. Oh, yeah. And later on, there's something that will come in handy. You don't have to waste a lot of bullets if you're not worried. that sound as well. It sounds like uh, if you ever go to the dentist and you like get your teeth cleaned, they use that special brush that just sounds like this would be real. Like, it sounds bad. <laughs> soldier. So you find like a lot of cool stuff if you go searching for it. Oh, we're, we're a little too drunk for a gun. I think the 
pistol looks different in this game too. Like, I don't remember it being like this golden. So now I know that some things can be surprising to me because we're playing the more remastered. So it's cool to see some of the things they went back and like changed. How are you doing, Rap? This uh, how's the job? It's hot. What's going on? I don't know what his plan was. <laughs> like, literally, that was like an Indiana Jones moment. <laughs> like, like that guy with the swords. Uh, and then, like, India, Indy just pulls out his gun and shoots him in the middle. Kiss. Yes. Well, you only live once. Yo, love. Remember that? Remember that word? <laughs> Press to throw a fiery grenade. Hold and release to create an explosive trap. <coughs> that wasn't no sample. So already this is different from uh, from the first two Bioshocks. In the first two Bioshocks, you weren't able to use your power to uh, make traps like that. And yeah, it was horrible. Oh, it wasn't worth that bad. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry to hear that, man. Hope it's better. Uh... <laughs> There we go. to Colombia is out. Let's go some alternative ways. All roads lead to Rome, right? <laughs> Look at this fucking... That, now that's some advertisement. When your mascot's riding a fucking pig. The blue ribbon. Finest quality. Bacon so good you could swear it flew. <laughs> or, or, oh, damn it. <laughs> I should have made the joke of uh, bacon so uh, good that you could have sworn the swine flu. Sorry, I feel bad. I, 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 should, I should go. Okay, let's uh, go in here real quick. I'll uh, pause. I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I have to piss after making a terrible joke like that. 
Individual uh, revolution awarded you know, 500 uh, silver and three pieces. Get them for the blue. You've unlocked three pieces of gear. Collect them for the blue. Okay, cool. You must collect all rewards before continuing. Okay, yeah, hold up. I'll be right back. Let's go pee.
Okay, I'm back. Awesome. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we'll back right into it. That's some items we can collect here, apparently. Like armor, other different sets. I think you only get those if you pre-order the game. But since we didn't pre-order anything, it doesn't matter. Okay. A look back at opening day. The dream of the prophet is finally aloft. Columbia begins her journey to spread America's vision to the world. Then, <laughs> the prophet stands up to the foes with, within and without. You like my 1950s slight announcer? The Chinese boxers take hostage. The prophet of Colombia stands up for America. What thanks does Colombia get? Washington to Comstock, stand down! We stand behind the Prophet! And... Those eggheads at Washington think they know better! We'll show them by putting them in the oven! Uh, I mean, huh? <laughs> A cloudy America recalls her first finest city. No thanks to, says the prophet. We're fine on our own. Yeah, yeah I, that's what I did for the other part. <laughs> oh, yeah. We've got some awards here. Why are you following me? Why are you following us? A pair of teeth. Get special clothing uh, that grants you unique abilities. You can wear four pieces of at, at a time. Okay. New pants. Ghost soldier. Killing the vi killing with a vigor traps has a seventy percent chance to cause the enemy uh, gun to become ghostly ally. Oh, okay. Interesting. So enemies will literally turn at random points and kill all the people. New hat, electrical punch. Set a chance uh, that a melee target is stunned, a victim is vulnerable to uh, within four seconds. Okay. New boots, eagle strike. Increase weapon damage by 50% on skylines. We're definitely gonna do that. Ammo, uh, ammo, ammo advantage uh, increases clip size for all weapons by 75, 75. Interesting. So yeah, we're able to wear all four. Some wine. That all that was in here? It's more beer, liquid. Oh, we have other gear here too. New pants, bull, bull rush, melee targets are knocked back. Oh, let's keep the ghosts, and we'll we'll take it. New boots. Betrayer. Killing a uh, possessed human causes them to explode nearby enemies. Oh, that's really good. We'll take it. We could probably use that later on. Extra, extra! We found voxophones provide silver eagles. We could use that. Um, what was the other one? Electrical punch. We could definitely use that. They're giving us like a whole 
lot of shit. Huh. Uh, health? Nice. Shield. This is a good place to stop. Uh, where else? Shield. New boots. Handyman Nemesis increases damage against Handyman by 50%. There's not a lot of Handyman in this, so that is probably useless. Uh, so we'll take it, but... It's not like handymen are like dropping out of nowhere and we're not killing them fast enough. Fleet feet. Uh, when evading mo movement speeds are increased, blah, 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 affects uh, strafing and backpedaling. Okay. We don't need it, but we'll take it. The difference between life and death. Give me a minute. Sugar rush. After eating a snack, move fifty percent faster than for three seconds. Again, not need it, but that's cool that we have it. Okay. Anything else here? No. Okay. I think we're good for now. I think we can move on. It's where you can hear echoes in this place all over. Shield. What was that? Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point. Notice all these people in here are dead for some reason. Who got to kill them? Well, I know. Is it just that guy who's dead in here? I thought there was more people. Apparently not. Father Comstock called on me today to write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, Father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, why settle for less? And then the prophet looks to me and says, 100 will suffice as I know how it ends. Yeah. So he knows something that really doesn't make any sense later. Oh, that's what it was. It was the anniversary of, when, uh, of them seceding from the Union. Oh! Damn hook must be magnetized. Yes. Yeah, that's not how magnetism works. It's not that strong. Okay, now there is an upgrade that we're gonna need later. So by us, like, attach it to these hooks, as soon as we land down on something, we can light it on fire. Because very easy. Oh yeah, 
had to run that far, honestly. You love this gun? Yeah. I love this gun, too. I find the shotgun more satisfying, too. There's, like, two different shotguns in this game. Yeah, we might have to move away from this area, because that's probably going to be under set soon. Yep. Oh shit, we gotta remember, we have powers, we can use them. Quit that. It's so easy to kill them with, like, various things. You don't even use half the power in this game. Shield. Like we said, we gotta look out for like different areas we can just drop down on. I think we can. Yeah, there we go. It's another hit hidden area here. Did somebody say I went inside here? Don't seem to be in a hurry to get me. Yeah, now I remember. Yeah, there's a there's a safe here that we can unlock, and we get another upgrade. Yeah, here it is. Locked. Yeah. This chest is locked, so we have to find like a key for it. Uh, stay alert for a key. I think it's somewhere in here. Otis works sense. up at the lodge part-time. He took this box from one of their secret ceremonies. And I know for sure, there is something dear inside. Problem is, Otis is more fool than not. He didn't bother to also secure a key ah, okay, from the yeah. Feathered Brothers to open the damn thing. So yeah, we need to go to the that weird mason cult. Don't move. Don't move a fucking muscle. Then I scream. Yeah, I don't like that sound. Yeah, it sounds like something's screaming outside here. It's not just hallucinating. Okay. Yeah, so we have to progress a little bit further. Uh, and then we have to come back here after we find that key. Because I... I think that has the upgrade that I'm looking for. Anything 
else going on in here? No. Nope. Okay, nothing else we could find. All right, let's keep going. We got a lot of money that we need to spend. Oh boy. The, a meeting of the Columbia Friends of Negro Society. Until the Negro is lethal, none of us are evil. Oh god. Tim, the one they're after. Go. They're looking for you. Police, we're in need of your assistance. They're here! Oh, these are Shh. allies. Keep your voice down. Right, they're allies. That's what it is. All right, let's move on. They believe that yeah, the Negroes need to be truly equal. That that's good. Good people. I I won't shoot them. That, that, that's good. Yeah, look at that. They're protecting them. The hospital. Abraham Lincoln. That, that that's how you know they're they're all on the up and up. Although there's some history behind Abraham Lincoln that may not look good, but let's not get into that. It's the thought that counts. I have to worry about death. Uh, I don't have to worry about jump scares. That's for sure. I just do my own thing. I, 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 you can do your own fighting style in this game, and there's no wrong answer. Cop shot came by the wagon at dawn. Man was just. He just transfixed by my trophy scout. Wow, about the white ones there. Show? I said, well, sir. If your quarry dwells in the jungle and beds down with the local color, why split hairs? <laughs> Not a chuckle out of him. Either he ain't seen a man go native, or maybe, maybe too many. Anyhow, now it's got me hunting down this Daisy Fitzroy. Hope we don't expect me to stuff and mount her. <laughs> Not even he was entertained by his own racist antics. Jesus Christ. <laughs> so I guess, yeah, they, he pretty much hired Craven the Hunter to hunt down Daisy Fitzroy. And I think throughout this game, uh, you can get a telling of his hunts and what he's learned about Daisy Fitzroy and what he found out about himself later. I think the story ends with him realizing that he's garbage and Daisy Fitzroy and the rest of them are actually justified. I think. I don't know. Don't don't at me. Yeah, no, we're not gonna keep looking at these slideshows. Pretty much it's more propaganda. Oh, 
Okay, this. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, they're afraid of me. I didn't even hit them. Okay, whatever. I didn't even hit you. Okay, yeah, and this is where we get to the other end of this game. Um, hopefully, we can go back. I think this becomes a save zone. Ooh, yeah. More racist propaganda. Comstock fights the Serpent of Nations. Obviously, that is a Jewish person and a Asian. And, uh, I'm not sure what the, the other race is. Ah, black. Yeah. 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 It gets bad. I am kind of glad this game did not come out in the time that it did. Like, if this game came out now, a lot of people would probably have problems with it and try to cancel it. When it's not trying to be racist, it's just literally being historically accurate. This is literally the kind of shit that would be in this time. It happens. What are they called? The... Adamus Patria Nostra Defundre. Oh, so they're like clans. <laughs> Which is weird. They're supposed to be like, um. They're supposed to be a certain group that. I forgot what they're called. The. the the um, Freemasons. Freemasons are like very in, in deep. What? But <laughs> I, I forgot. I don't. Know. I'm sorry. Uh, let's point out the fact that they have a statue of John Wilkes Booth as a hero. I got glad, glad the the game added in like shit all over this guy. <laughs> Oh, no. fuck! Okay, he's in another thing. Actually, I'm gonna he's not innocent. He's far from innocent. Angel Columbia gave onto the founders the tools to build a new Eden. They did so without hesitation. For 85 years, they prepared the way of the Lord. But when the great apostate came, he brought war with him, and the fields of Eden were soaked with the blood of brothers. The only emancipation he had to offer oh, yeah. was death. <laughs> <laughs> like literally this is deep in in the weeds they thought Abraham was the devil <laughs> Jesus Christ I, I'm, gu I'm guessing that uh Robert E. Lee over there. Or is that at least his escort?
This is a great way to learn American history, uh, uh, Raftus, if, you, if you're not familiar with it. <laughs> not, well, not all of this is 100% because it's this game, but... If you're here to learn, like, the, the racist parts of America, you're in infantry. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, so uh, we're done searching down there. Yeah, a lot of our time is going to be built on uh, me searching around for different items. So we, we really want to get everything in that area. To the sorrow below, the true mission our founders have given us. And when the uh. bandits and hypocrites of Washington betrayed him, our prophet did not heal. Yeah, so he this is why I thought they were Freemasons. Because this is a dance, this is sort of a step they do the when someone has passed. About to fry these fucking crows. See what happens? What the fuck? Oh, that's the uh, upgrade that allows like random guns to show up anywhere. <laughs> oh, found the key. Awesome. So now we can go back and uh, open that chest. Better already. While we're searching around, let's what get some audio. Exactly? Was the great emancipator emancipating the Negro from? From his daily bread, from the nobility of honest work, from wealthy patrons who sponsored them from cradle to grave, from clothing and shelter. And what have they done with their freedom? Why, go to Finkton and you shall find out. No animal is born free, except the white man. Oh, and it is God. Ah. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Playing this game is gonna be fun. <laughs> it's gonna be more satisfying because now there is no like moral structure where they're telling you oh should you kill this person or not or is it a right thing to do, uh, do this and that. No, 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 Everything in here is justified. If you want to steal and kill people, you have the right to because you know exactly what these people are about. Okay, now we gotta go back. Oh yeah, more enemies spawned in this area. That's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted. Yeah, don't need, need much. Okay. 
Okay. You gotta hop on up here. Hop on down here. How come there was money? Did, did we just miss money here? Okay. So we just missed money that was here. Perfect. Hey. More potions. Here. That guy's gone. Yeah, this sounds like there's stuff here. Okay, so let's just run on back. Kind of skip over a lot of the uh, same shit. Once we get past here, we'll be well on our way to getting to Colombia. Colombia, oh na na. <laughs> In Havana, Havana, oh na na. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot to get the shot of the mural over here. What does this say in the, in the middle here? Protecting our race. Oh, God. Yeah. I think... Now, I think... I, I'm not 100% sure, but I think for advertisement for this game, this mural was on it. Hey, yeah, this, this right here is America. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh boy. This afternoon, the scoundrel, believed now by many to be Vox Populi, began his terrible rampage. Trouble began almost instantly. Full of wrath and bent on harm, the anarchist maliciously wounded several Colombian peacemakers, before then arming himself and firing into an assemblage of virtuous fair-goers. As of this hour, he is considered wholly responsible for causing at least eight God-fearing Colombians to meet their maker in heaven. He is considered brimming with danger and evil intent, and we implore you not to tempt ruination by facing him without aid of Columbia's finest. Now, back to the music. And in my opinion, he may be a communist, huh? Well, maybe. Push. Pull the button. I think this is another loading area. I think. No, I don't know. Still continue. Oh, then you know what I want. Give me the moolah. Oh yeah, good old propaganda, right? The white brain is different from the colored brain. Sweet mother of Colombia, why do we worship three symbols in your memory? We worship the sword, so that we might avenge you. We worship the raven, 
so that we might cover the city with eyes. We worship the coffin because it symbolizes the weight of our faith. Uh, that's not what I was told. Uh, I was told the sword, the key, and the scroll. The fuck are you guys talking about? Urgent care. Disease shield. I'm sorry. Decrease. Wow. Disease. Decrease shield. Uh, recharge delay. Uh, the ghost soldier is pretty good. So we'll take it, but we're not going to use it. You could easily just walk by it and not notice that was there. Perfect. Oh no. As if we were gonna save that guy. We are going to light his life aflame. You can fire her now! Fire! Oh, that was an accident. Bosses are a lot easier. What's this? Some new kind of vigor? That's a hell of a thing. So you know how in first Bioshock we had to deal with bees? Well, this is the other one. Crows! Press to summon murderous crows. Hold and release to create a nest trap. Damage on So we barely had to touch him. Like, this is what I mean. There are no wrong answers in uh, fighting these guys. It's whatever you want to do. Good. This is the one that I wanted. Yeah. I want to switch out the electric for the blaze. I haven't gotten much with the electric, but I, I, I'm way more used to the fire than anything. So we're going to equip it. Yeah, there you go. The Lost Shepherd, this anarchist, is either a Milano dwarf or a French man with a missing left eye. No more than four months Why so space. specific? You're a mulatto man or a guy, a Frenchman. Telescope. Okay, yeah, we're very close to the Monument Island. Cheese. They're big nose, huh? Likeness. 
Do you look like me? <laughs> Holy shit! We took half that guy's head off! Yeah, I want no quarrel with you. Even though you just added me to the cops. This game was way more violent than I remember. Oh, I can't even show his head. Like, completely gone. That looks familiar. That's just Andrew Ryan. That is just Andrew Ryan. Who is she describing him to? What, like, I am so confused. Huh. Interesting. Is that just like... Maybe she just saw a portal of someone she thought was me. Huh. Interesting. Okay, we've done our job here. I thought there was more here. I guess that was just a really interesting Easter egg. Oh, thank you. Thunder Gun Express. Never give up. Never surrender. Okay, yeah, so I think we hit Monument Area, so, yeah. Uh, so, so, yeah, it, it gets a little bit easier to get through uh, each area if you're not exploring everything. So. We would have been here faster, though, you know me. Nah, I don't need any more. Wait. Are these to upgrade them? That's ability. Oh, I didn't even know. Yeah, I would like to upgrade these, please. Ah, uh, not enough money. Possession now nah. turns machine okay. and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap. Okay, so now I know. Ah. Okay, buy more ammo, health. Which we're good. We don't need that. A lot of these become like a need. They're more of a want than a need. Let's try out this new possession. You there. Do my best.
<laughs> the horde fi okay so what this game is missing is you know how in last of us 2 if you like shoot a guy's arms off like they start agonizing in pain this is what that game's missing is like if you shoot somebody in their arms or legs they're like crawling on the ground begging for mercy but it's bordering on there already so adding more of that would just be even more PTSD inducing. <laughs> like, holy cow. Uh, any. We're gonna try to run these. Acting like we're on a, like a time crunching air clock. See, we're already back to our full health. That's how much we don't care about our health. I mean, no, care about your actual health, not not like your fake health. But do do care about your health, please. I appreciate a lady that appreciates value. <laughs> Did I hear that right? Many <laughs> machines are hilarious. Okay, so we can get the devil's kiss. That would use a lot of money. No. Biggest promotion of this game is Whoa. the skyline hug. Like, I think the skyline hook might go down as like the greatest uh, video game weapons. Like right next to like the needler and all those things. In my opinion, I don't know about everybody else. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. I saw something. See that hook right there, right? There's gotta be something there, but I guess we'll come back later on. It's important. I would burn it up. We're 
die. I don't need that. And the Lord saw the wickedness of man was great, and he repented he had made man on the earth. Rain! Forty days and forty nights of the stuff, and he left not a thing that walked alive. You see, my friends, even God is entitled to a do-over. And what is Columbia if not another ark for another time? So in other words, ethnic cleansing. <laughs> That's terrible. That's pretty much his plan, is ethnic cleansing. <laughs> There's another skyline up above. As long as I get some elevation, I can probably reach it. Give me too much power in this game. Like, too much. Oh, shit! Ex executioner. Melee strikes against staged enemies at 60% chance to critical hit. Victims take 25% more damage. Ah! Ammo advantage is pretty good. Okay, we'll put it on, and if we don't like it, we can switch it up. How about that? Stop him! Really didn't have a plan there, did you guys? Run run towards the very armed man, right? <laughs> Almost got to the monument. Uh, are they shooting at us? Yeah, they are. Stand down! Stand down! the Delaware with flame and the wings of angels. Watch over me and lend me strength. Father Washington. Now, should we give them a good kill? I mean, we can literally wipe them off the place of the uh, face of the earth. Right now. Look here for example. Uh, Lady Comstock, bless him and keep him. Okay. Now, nah. <laughs> they're unarmed. They're, they're not going to do any harm towards us. I know why you've come, false shepherd. I see every sin that blackens your soul. Wounded knee, the Pinkertons, the drink, the gambler. And of course, Anna. And now, to repay a debt, you've come from my land. But 
not all debts can be repaid, Booker. You don't know me, pal. Prophecy is my business, Mr. DeWitt. As blood is yours. Do you know why these men will die for me? Because I've seen their future in the glory. And hence they are content. What brought you to Columbia, Booker? Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt? This will end in blood, DeWitt. But then again, it always does with you, doesn't it? It always ends in blood. You don't know me. Jesus. Only you I know me, and you're not me. But thy crook is bent, and thy path is twisted. twisted. Go back to the Sodom from which you came. Okay, pick up their guns. It's fine. I'll need them. Yeah, I do not remember the guns being this like. Go back. This is definitely a uh, remaster. Holy shit. I come here, I come looking for a girl, and this is how you guys do me as a guest. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. Lady. What the fuck are you doing here? Yeah, I'm gonna hijack this sure I can get this thing going. The Lord forgives everything. I'm just a prophet, prophet, so I don't have to. Amen. Amen. Oh shit! Jesus, woman. Oh, well, here. Hope dying for a cause is worth it. thing go down yeah that's gonna hit the surface well that's not for us to decide huh playing uh donations impact oh okay that's cool okay okay I, I was I, I figured like you were doing some other stuff it's all cool man I appreciate you coming by though, you know, um, it, it, despite me not being able to announce that, hey, I was playing this today, I kind of fucked that up today because of bad Wi Fi at work. Uh, so, yeah, I appreciate you still uh, coming by and sporting. Yeah, hopefully we can get to Monument Island and finish that area up. Oh, well, we're at Monument Tower, but um, if we can get to Elizabeth and call this a good session, then yeah, the rest will be pretty good. There it is. Monument Island. Wonder where they got her locked up in this place. I don't think place. we have to fight anyone in this chapter. To my knowledge. Well, it's a good thing they set up a hug here. Yeah, but when I'm uh, writing to you, the support would be better. Eh! It's fine. Just knowing an audience is here and watching is even sweeter. The seed of the prophet shall sit in the throne and drown in the flame the mountains of man. There's 
I think there's a tape from my old slave man that used to work here. Oh god, yeah, and he has a white woman that he adores. That that doesn't look good. I guess even in a restricted area, these crackers need someone to clean the floors. <laughs> <laughs> Those politicians and scientists don't bother about what they say around me because I'm some half leaded colored boy. But I can tell they scared out of their wits by that thing they got the locked upstairs. Yes, sir. They got a tiger by the tail. And they don't know whether to hang on or run. <laughs> yeah, you tell them. <laughs> These. <laughs> I like tired old black men who still works hard. He's fucking great. <laughs> age one, age five, age 11, 17. So she's 17 years old or 18. What's this? Fox Populi crime board. Hmm. Why do they have it as a ratio? Like they actually know when the next crime's gonna happen. Siphon passive. Changes, huh? Oh, they change color because they're not from our reality, huh? Ah. Well, it's reality can be manipulated. That's the way to go. So this is not the way to go, so we'll follow that. Uh, Mr. Thompson, sir, I, I replaced the entire fuse banker's ass, and the lights were all in working order last night. Last night? There they go again. We go through boxes of fuses every day as of late, and they're just in the siphon alone. I don't... Oh! oh something's happening! What, uh, uh. what the fuck just happened? What the hell are they doing to her? Doing nothing good. Then what happened to the black men? to the tired old black men. Lock for the tip. This must have been investigating codes. Interesting. Specimen painting.
Yeah, so pretty much they've been uh, monitoring her this whole time. That that that's it. That's all you need to know. They've been monitoring her. They've been watching like, her. Yeah, since she was a child, and it's disgusting how much they've been watching, like that photo right there. Yeah. Not very tasteful, huh? It is one thing to imagine one's future, and another to see it. I have seen the seeds of fire that will prepare the Sodom below for the coming of the Lord. But Elizabeth shall sow those seeds, not I. Mm. I will fall before the job is done. But she shall take up my mantle. The Lord is calling me home. I'll see I feel you his love in every here. tumor. Oh. Because they are the train which yeah. takes me to his station. And I go with joy, knowing that Elizabeth will take my earthly place. But the false shepherd is coming to lead my lamb astray. I will not board that train until she is safe from his deceptions. Oh, I didn't even know there was a, a extra bottle back there. Oh, cool. two-way mirrors. Perfect. Dressing room. That's where we need to go. You know what's creepy? All of, like, the uh, fans that kept shipping Booker DeWitt and Elizabeth. Pretty fucked up. open the portal in time. Here we are. Now she's going to tear open the portal in time. And there's an interesting Easter egg in this. Whoa! La nice. Revenge de Jedi. That's Revenge of the Jedi, which is the alternate version of Return of the Jedi in a different dimension. Got nothing to do with the it, job. Actually, fun fact, that's what um, George Lucas was going to call uh, Return of the Jedi was Revenge of the Jedi. So, yeah. Cool fact. A cool Easter egg there. This job's getting worse all the time. And that was an Easter egg too. Yeah. 
so, so that was an Easter egg he just dropped too. He said this job is keep, keeps getting worse. That's uh, um, that's uh, uh, Lando Calrissian's uh, line in uh, in the Revenge of the in the Empire Strikes Back. Sorry. <laughs> what makes the girl different? I suspect it has less to do with what she is, and rather more with what she is not. A small part of her remains from where she came. Yes, it would seem awesome. the universe does not like its peas mixed with its porridge. She's a very simple girl. She just wants to see Paris. Interacted with his daughter outside of her being a baby. I'm, I'm pretty sure if he had interacted with her, she went would have probably went down his path of being evil and never went anywhere with Booker to win. Why did that do that? Uh, hello. Ah! Hey, Are you reading the Trojan it off. Stop it. Will you stop it? I'm not here to hurt you. Who are you? My name is DeWitt. I'm a friend. I come to get you out get of here. Get away. Huh. Are you real? I'm real enough. Real than your you, you've got to go. Why? You don't want to be here when he gets here. Just a minute, I'm getting dressed. Get you out of here. There's no way out. Trust me, I've looked. Stop it, you're, you're too impatient. That's enough. What about this? What about it? This is the way out, isn't it? What are you... Give it to me. Here? Nope, nothing. Okay, it's a yeah. way out. Straight into the fry. Come on, this way. Okay. It's his job to keep me locked up in here. We'll see about that. So, why is there a lack of Big Daddy thing here? Besides Who the handyman. Why did you come here? Well, we have a different kind of big daddy. A bigger daddy. Biggest daddy. This way, come on! Too big, too big. They were watching me? Or too big, too All bad. Batter daddy. Why? Why did they put me in here? Bigger what static. am I? <laughs> Ew. <No>. What am I? <laughs> You're the girl who's getting out of this tower. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There it is. This way. Oh, am I stuck? Oh, we okay. have to keep moving. He's tearing the building apart. Be careful, Elizabeth. How do you know my name? Not now.
Yeah, so this big daddy can fly, and that's not great. How, how can it fly? Beats me. Physically, that doesn't seem possible. Oh shit. That would be terrifying to live in this place. Is knowing that thing is flying around. even made of like I, I get like the big daddies are used to be human so they are like humanoid in a way and they're just like nothing but like skinless flesh underneath what do you want with her tell me what you want with her are you going to hurt her tell me what you want Still hit the baby? Yeah, okay. Yeah, so she's the only thing that changes in this game that, that I can remember. I, I think everything else stays the same though. Anna! Anna! Okay, cool. So, yeah, as soon as we load into this area, uh, I think that, that'll be it for today. Um, cause I gotta get to bed. Anna. Anna. No, it's me, Elizabeth. Are you alright? Where am I? Next Back next time the is the, the ending phase, I guess. Here, yeah, I, I think I'm so. Um, if we're fast to... enough. I said I'm fine. Just, just, just give me a minute. Do you hear that? Oh, that's music. I'm going. I just. Oh, just need to... Okay, I, I won't be long. I, 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 I would long say we'll have like two more sessions of this game, and then. Um, we should be done. I mean, yeah, there's not really much to this game. Where is she? Yeah, it'd be possible, yeah. Okay. Coolio, cool beans. All right. Yeah, let's uh, give our thanks and uh, we'll say goodbye for tonight. Um... Friday we'll keep on going and uh, we'll play some more. Uh, I do have like a lot line of like games that I want to do next after this because um, it just down on the oh man I, I haven't played this game yet and um, if I could find the right stuff to set up maybe I can just whip out like the PS2 or something like that or um, uh, PlayStation 3 definitely but but yeah, if I can find all the things for it, I can start playing some older games. Um, hopefully, I have all my old PS2 and Xbox games. I don't ever sell a lot of Xbox games. Like once I have a game, I have it to collect. So uh, yeah, well, thank you so much, Raptors, for coming out. I, I appreciate uh, you coming out. Um, uh, ho hopefully, work goes better for you next time. Um, I don't know if you're going to work now or um, or 
probably going to go back to bed before you have to go go to work. So um, have a good night or a good morning, depending on uh, uh, where you are. So in like two hours. OK. All right. <laughs> well, um, enjoy work then. So uh, good. Thanks. And then uh, already. Well, thank you guys so much for coming out. Um, and uh, those who haven't seen this stream, unfortunately, uh, thank you for like uh, popping by and just seeing uh, what what I'm playing today. Um, I'll be posting this on YouTube later. Uh, and uh, in case you missed this, you know, uh, I will be streaming Friday. And uh, Friday, uh, I'll pretty much be continuing uh, more Bioshock Infinite. Uh, hopefully, we'll, it'll be our last session in this game, depending on what I'll be doing uh, and how fast I am. So, can't make any promises, but I uh, appreciate everybody coming back, uh, coming out and supporting. And uh, hopefully uh, things are going better for you if, if it haven't. Um, and uh, always remember, uh, do the best you can. You can't always do everything. You know, um, take a break sometimes. You know, uh, take a step back and think of things you can do. So, uh Thank you guys so much for coming out. Uh, check me out on Twitter. I'll keep a schedule. Uh, check me out on uh, TikTok, uh, Caleb, eight, uh, Caleb the Fish Zero. Got plenty of uh, videos on there doing random stuff. Uh, and uh, check me out on Caleb the Fish on YouTube. So thank you guys so much. Peace.